making this little vlog because I have a big announcement to make and it's in regards to my Depop. So first of all, I'm having a buy one get one free sale on my Depop shop on everything pretty much. And I'm gonna ship out all of these orders right now. And I already dropped off like 10 in the morning. I'm having this big sale because I am gonna be out of town for about three weeks. So I won't be able to ship anything, of course. I'm gonna take a little vacation and I'm gonna vlog it. I'm gonna try to do my best and have it up for you guys while I'm on vacation because it might be up to a month long. I'm gonna announce my last ship shipment date on my Depop, of course, and then when I get back, of course. Oh, if you're new, by the way, I have a Depop. My Depop is at O underscore it's Lissa. Um, make sure you follow me. I saw a lot of cute, baddie, vintage, cute clothes, dope clothes, you know what I mean? I'm gonna go ahead and start shipping this stuff out. Let's do it. Sometimes I cut like way too long for my string and I have to um, cut it, but it's fine. My floor ends up looking like a mess because I just throw everything on the floor and then at the end I just clean it all, so. So this girl's bundle, she got some Tommy Hilfiger jeans, carpenter jeans, and some vintage Lee jeans. Beautiful bundle. I love this bundle. cardigan is so cute i thrifted a lot of these clothes from last video i know i said i was gonna make a thrift haul but i couldn't just because i had to post everything that i could before i leave so that's really the reason why but i promise next time i go thrifting which will be another big one as soon as i come back i'm gonna go thrifting who knows, I might go thrifting over there where I'm going. So a lot of you guys have messaged me on Depop asking for advice and stuff. I do want to make a video on like the most frequently asked questions on Depop. If you guys want to see something like that, just let me know and I can make something like that. Because I just want to help you guys, you know, like everyone can eat everyone can get a piece of the pie you know love 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 is fun so cute so once i package everything i like to put the names on it and then i will go ahead and measure everything so I have my weight scale, my Sharpie. That way it makes it easier when I put everything in online. I can just look at it and go. So this is three ounces. One pound, seven ounces. 
Remember guys, anything over a pound, you measure it. 10 times three. You can be approximate with these polymellers. If something is 3.4 ounces, if it's ever 0.4, always double check because if it goes to 0.5, then you need to round up. But if it's at 0.4, just round down, round down. Eight, nine, three. Nine, eight, three. And I already measured that one. I'm gonna go ahead and start printing all the labels. I don't think you guys need to see this part because I'm gonna have all the information of the people's stuff on here and yeah, I don't need to see that. So if you guys haven't seen my PayPal shipping video, I go into depth into that video. So go check that out, okay? But yeah. Aftermath of my shipping. This is my little shipping station. So I'm gonna give you like a little tiny mini desk tour right now, just because. But um, I do have some basically some tech stuff and random stuff in there this is a lot of my creative stuff so i have my thank you cards cutters markers all of that and here down here i have my trash can and my sticker organizer um those two cans were actually for a baby shower those little like pop cannons but don't worry about that so this is the majority of my stuff so i have all my polymellers in here um of course i'm trying out some recyclable ones i have used like over a hundred of these recyclable ones from eco and clothes they're really good bag um and then i have my paper i have some recycled like cardstock paper and some paper here um just different kinds of paper my scale some stickers i got this organizer on amazon this is like a rose gold organizer really comes in clutch i highly recommend i will link all this in the description um and i got just some random stuff in here that i really don't go to if i sell jewelry i have these polymellers well not polymellers um bubble bags i don't even know what these are called i totally forgot i'm having a brain fart but yeah i have that in there but i don't really use them much because i don't have a lot of jewelry to sell of course my printer i have all my boxes and stuff like that here and then all these i get for free at the post office and then i have some fake plants and stuff and like an organizer some candles and all that good stuff and then i have this chair here that usually just holds junk and of course the adjustable chair so this is my little station hope you guys enjoyed that mini tour quick update on the shipping area this is inventory area i try to let my limit myself to one shelf to keep things moving i usually have two stacks in front of each other and i am selling out of a lot of good stuff so go check it out you guys i have a little bit of stuff left and of course a bunch of shoes in there so thank you guys so much for watching i really hope you guys enjoyed this little late night ship with me slash work with me for depop um, it's getting really hot in here because of these lights and your girl needs to go to sleep. So subscribe and like this video if you enjoyed it. I really, really appreciate it. And thank you guys so much for the support. And yeah, stay safe. Be safe. Be you. Be beautiful. Believe it. Be it. Um, yeah, I'm just talking at this point. <laughs> All right, we gotta go. Bye.